What is going on guys? My name is Ron Becky. I'm from Round Reviews here with another episode reaction to Spy X Family. I'm not wearing pants. Now, before I get into this episode, we got a actually pretty good preview of last episode of what's going to happen in this episode. As you guys saw at the very end of the of the post credits scene, Yuri got introduced for the first time finally. We had only seen him in pictures and I believe that in a flashback that was it. We had never seen what he looked like because he was always covered with uh, very peculiar objects that just happened to block his face. Just so we didn't really, really see how what he actually looked like in current time. Um, we are going to be in for a treat this episode because Yuri is a quite a character. Uh, not as much as uh, another character that will be joining um, but that'll be a topic for another time, if we actually get to it in the next five episodes. Four episodes after this one. So, yeah, I'm gonna jump into this episode reaction, so without further ado, let's jump in to episode eight of Spy X Family, starting in three, two, one, let's jam. I still think this is my favorite opening. Your boy Kong Ming, Kong Min, Kong Min is also a really good opening. Kaguya Sama also really good. But the more I listen to this, I think just in terms of like pure enjoyment, I think Kaguya Sama. Or no, I'm sorry, sorry, Kaguya Sama second. Um, actually, no, I think I like Young Kong Ming more. This is the favorite though, still by far. I have no idea. Totally wrong. <laughs> A for effort? Oh, handler. Give me the soundtrack. Nice, an espresso. <laughs> <laughs> Four. And they really are dressed in the part. Like those military uniforms. Oh, and now she's going to tell on everyone, yep. Hey, haven't seen her since episode two. Things happen, okay? Hmm. 
And they look identical. I mean, in terms of, like, it would be basically a gender swapped. Damn. That's a permanent scar right there. I don't think it's possible to not have a uh, cigarette burn not be a scar. Twenty. So that was seven years. I thought it was. I thought it was older. A little bit older, but yeah. <laughs> Maybe like some good cop, bad cop kind of vibe, but no, not like in terms of like. Not really good cop, bad cop, but more of like a, uh... I can't think of the actual right terminology. So he has a soft-hearted exterior, but he's also really serious. Just signed your own uh, death warrant. You can flip a switch. You can definitely flip a switch. <laughs> Those eyes, man. <laughs> Probably, probably, that's not really, a uh, kid-appropriate. I mean, yes. Which is a fourth.
<laughs> Just gotta put him up really quickly. <laughs> Even he's a little. <laughs> Uh, Anya, I love you. I love how she's on five, he's on one. Oh. Holy ass! He deserved that. He deserved the bra button. I mean, you're not wrong. Yeah, that would be interesting if they ever found out that he worked. Is that a coffee grinder? It's a, actually a cool coffee grinder. Kind on the exterior, the interior though. Those fucking flowers, bro. I'll never get past those flowers. So his poker face is not as good as he thinks. Yeah. Yeah, that's a very fair. Mm. That's fair. From her point of view, I mean. I actually don't remember the specifics of what happens during this. Okay, you know that's fair too. Bruh. <laughs> <sighs> uh, 
Right? I I completely agree with you, Lloyd. Look at that face. Is that Carpaccio? No, it's good. And now you're hate eating it. It looks like salmon carpaccio. Okay, that's just cheese and bread. That is a salmon carpaccio. Or very similar. I don't why am I caring about this? I don't know. Yeah, last time you got drunk. Uh, Yeah. Cheese. He's uh, slipping a little bit. No. <laughs> He's a character. He's a character. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, he cooks good. Your words, not mine. Not that I'm disagreeing. Oh, is he gonna... S is that Hungaria? Just without the end? Oh, it's supposed to be Hungary, because, you know, hungry. Sorry, I don't know why I said Hungary. Hmm. Damn. Damn, Lloyd. I don't remember any of this. I'm actually kind of glad that uh, I'm starting to like not remember a lot of stuff because I kind of want to go back into this pretty blind. Well, as blind as possible since, you know, I've already read a good chunk of it. For now. Just training.
You should see the other guys. It's not mine. Sip, yep, yep. Probably should clean a little bit before. I forgot what, how old was she when she uh, started the whole assassination training thing? Understandable. I mean, Lloyd. I love how he's the one given the nickname. Did her uh, heart flutter there a little bit? <laughs> Logic out the window. Funny thing is, he's actually correct. No. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, no. Okay. Sorry, we have a we have a personal policy to not do PDA. Doesn't matter. Family doesn't family against. I love how it shows like this is him like thinking. Nuts. Oh, you fucking dick noodle. That's where you're going to end the episode. There better be a oh, fuck. There's no after credit scene, huh? I kind of know what happens. But the, why would the fuck would they end it there? I know why they would end it there. It's great on paper. But fuck you. I'm mad. I get it. I'm still mad. I can be both. I can be mad. I don't... Okay, so I'm trying to figure out how they're trying to pad this next episode. 
I'm really gonna try because I. Here's where things start really getting fuzzy. Up until where I ended off. <clears throat> voice crack, why? Up until where I ended up in the tennis tournament arc. To probably right around here. My memory's mo mo mostly shot. Although, granted, I will remember things later on. Like, I didn't. I remember this whole kiss scene. Once I saw it. So. A lot of those things could actually start happening the more I watch it. But, honestly, right now, I honestly don't really remember what happens right after this. There's a couple... In, even in between, like, the details that happen from here to this, right here. It's hazy. We'll see what happens. But anyways, guys, I thoroughly enjoyed this episode. Again, I have no pants. Uh, <laughs> it's hot in my room, okay? It's Vegas. It's, like, 98 degrees. It's... Not even close to the afternoon. Don't judge me. It's hot, okay? And if I have the fan on, you hear it. I normally have my fan on. But I can't because it's loud. Picks up on the microphone. So I'm in my pants. I have no pants, I mean. I'm pantsless. I'm like Gura. I should, I should wrap this up, okay? Anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know what you guys thought in the comment section below. And I will see you guys next week for Kaguya-sama. More than likely because I keep on saying I'm planning on doing something else, but... Time has not been a friend lately. But yeah, anyways, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.